All right, so I'm back at it. Um, last time I left off, I went ahead and uh, did a test area where I'm gonna do the transition from the flat area of the um, pad down to the curb, which is supposed to be six inches below this level. And mistakenly, when I cleared all of this material off the edges, I went down roughly, looks like this is eight inches. So between eight inches and a foot, I went down. So I have to level up from this line down six inches, make sure it's a smooth transition, and then go ahead and have a level uh, two foot curb um, going around the entire perimeter, um, which shouldn't be a problem. But yeah, let's get started. It's in the 80s today, but uh, there's a nice little breeze and um, it doesn't feel that humid. So I think I should be fine. I'm going to go ahead and mark the bucket. So uh, I'll be able to see uh, where the bottom of the blade is. So I'm going to mark it six inches. So once I line up the bucket to the, um, to the, to the string, I'll be able to know that that's six inches and that's where I need to stop the transition and uh, just level everything out from there. So let's see how it goes. All right, so I got one side done. It is sloping and it is level here, sloping there and good to go. So yeah, now I know what it takes to get one side of an Alaskan slab. One side down, three to go. And this one I have to push down the material, but uh, not a not a bad uh situation so 
I will pick this up later this evening or tomorrow first thing and try to get this thing done so I can lay the foam and uh, get ready for concrete in like a week or so.